Okay. So I went to Slippery Rock. Yes. You, you probably never heard of it. Yes. Uh, and when I got to the airport, the snow was up to here. Oh my. That the, was your welcome party. Yes. And <laughs> not appropriately dressed either. <laughs> the first 10 years were very interesting times. Yeah. Because you know when you go there when you're young, you tend to just settle on doing just whatever. And anyway, there wasn't much to save because we were only allowed $300 every quarter. So you, your parents could only send you $300 per quarter. Which stocks did you buy? I'm, I'm curious. Uh, as a gift, we had already received uh, a thousand stocks of BAT. So all of us had already gotten BAT, a gift of BAT. That's a, one of the most expensive yes. stocks in the market. And then you know KCB at that time used to do a lot of, uh, what do you call it, splits. Yes. So if you had 10,000, you find you have 20,000. Yes, yes, yes. Instead of them giving you cash, they yes. would give you shares. Yes. So you end up, you see your, <laughs> your share volume is growing. So growing, when, yes. when, you, uh, when you think about selling to buy now something, yeah you realize Allah it's quite something I, I have something yeah I have money yeah yeah, yeah. yeah, that's yeah, what, yeah. That's, so that wow. one, those, those some of those are uh, so we did there was BAT yeah uh, breweries yeah um, uh, BAT Brewery, KCB, KCB Barclays Bank when it was Barclays doing really Bank. really well yes. and when Safaricom came on you know yeah. it was a big push yeah, yeah, yeah. so we, we got into that as yeah, well yeah yeah oh so you got into all the blue chips well, we didn't know what they were called at yeah. that time. Once you see the just over there, you are sending. Okay, but at twenty, you are two more. Yes. But at hundred, you send. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Yes. 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 So, have have those investments paid you back? Yes, because when we wanted to buy land, uh, it was easy to dispose of them yeah. and see a huge amount of money. Yeah. And pay yeah. off. Yeah. Like if you. Uh, because if you're buying a piece of land yeah. and you it's a two million yeah. and you don't have two million saved up in the US, you yes. can dispose of your shares. your shares and you buy it. And, and it's you, only three days you have and, the money. And you, you're done. Yeah. yeah. Wow. That's 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 really amazing. Yes. So your second uh, decade, that then your third decade. Yes. Yes. Now you see, uh, the third decade was now you've really professionalized. I yeah. Professionalized yeah. In my career. Yeah. Uh, I was no longer at the bedside of uh, delivering care I was more outside consulting and yeah. so uh, i have seen a really yeah. a good transition yeah and so i can say for most people who came in my generation yeah. i think we've kind of had similar yeah. experiences. experiences yeah and you know when you arrive in the u.s or even in the diaspora countries yeah. Yeah. it's the person who houses you the first time yeah that can make or break Oh, really? You know your destiny, unless you're really, really like strong. With yes, it. yes, yes, yes. The yes, person yes. who houses you the first time, the first time you arrive there, yeah. uh, can who house can, you? I'm can, curious. Ch can channel you to to the right uh, to, to whatever the, it is they are doing. Yeah. Uh, I lived in school. That yeah. was my first experience as an adult living in a dorm. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and it was not. I so you are not like one of those Kenyans who go and uh, live with another Kenyan. No. No. So no. you. You are in school? Yes. Okay, so was that an advantage or a disadvantage? When I think about it res retrospectively, I think that was the best decision. I see. Because I don't know where I would have been yeah, yeah, yeah. if I had gone to live with a Kenyan initially. Initially, yeah. And then my siblings were lucky because when they came, they lived with me. Yes. So we had kind of, my mom and my dad had kind of already started steering us yeah, yeah. the way they wanted so to. So now you are, out, you are outside campus yes. and now you are the one welcoming yes. them and channeling them to the right parts. Correct. Nice. Back but to then, the but third decade. But then now yes. you, you realize that yes. most of them now have become nurses. Because I see. Yeah. I see. Yeah. So you, you see when so I say that. The power of influence. Influence is yes. very. Yeah. 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 Interesting. Uh -huh. Okay. So we are third decade. Yes. Uh, and does it have any, anything to do with what you're doing today in uh, with the women in NADS and what you're doing here today in Kenya? Correct. Yeah. Um, so in 2015, my parents were celebrating their 50th anniversary, and all of us came. Wedding, wedding anniversary. Correct. Yeah. And um, my mom. Yeah. My mom is very influential in my life. I have yes. to say that. Yes. And she had. She had put us in a small circle yeah. 
so all we were told be sending a hundred dollars a month don't ask too many questions just send so we were in a circle without knowing even what a circle was. Yes. Okay. Here in Kenya. Yes. yes. So we come home for their anniversary yes. and I meet all this variety of women in yes. this charm yes. uh, circle. Yes. They are all ages. Yes. And I'm like, what? This is amazing. Yeah. How do you get, tw and there were not many, yeah. how do you get 20 people, yes. three quarters, uh, at least a quarter of them are in the diaspora, because yeah, yeah, yeah. they've brought their daughters yeah, yeah, yeah. Into, into this circle, yeah, yeah. and make things happen. And they had been in, um, in existence for two years, yeah, yeah. and they'd already bought a big piece of land. Wow. And I'm like, I wish I could just see 20 women in the diaspora yeah, yeah, yeah. and i vocalized that and i said i wish at one point we would see this come to fruition in the yeah, diaspora yeah lo and behold one of our co-founders posts this random post yeah and i'm not even one of the very first people who were in the eight yes no oh i was like number four number five there yes. out of the women who ended up being the yeah. eight yeah and so it's not like we got into the circle knowing this is what really the circle does because yeah. even as we were contributing a hundred to this one of yes. my mom yes they do everything yes as they just come and tell us this is what we bought yes this is what we're doing with our money with your, with money. your money with your money yeah. yes yeah and so it's required a lot of uh going out there and learning from experts yeah yeah because yeah. yeah. all of us who are in who are co-founders mm. we are professionals in different careers yeah, yeah, yeah. we have nurses we have People who own businesses, yeah. uh, who are also in different parts of professions. Yeah. So that that is it's, yeah. it's interesting. Yeah. yeah. Interesting. So uh, it's amazing how all these things are interconnecting. Correct. Uh, your mother is doing was doing something which yes. is now you're doing in a bigger scale. In in, in nuts. Correct. And uh, also it's a hundred dollars. You you suck the hundred dollars. Yeah. So. I hope you're giving your mother all the all the credit all, she all deserves. The dividends. <laughs> <laughs> I, I do give we do give her a lot yeah. of credit. Yeah. Um, because I think sometimes you don't realize the power that your parents have in influencing your life. Yes. Um, and when you get good influence, yeah. it really can take you far. Yeah. And see possibilities where you can't yeah. even think of them. Yeah. Um, so I, I do credit her yeah. a lot. And yeah. I, I do credit also my dad. Yeah. He was the first one to buy us shares and give it to us. As yeah. 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 Yeah.